on that. Do you have any um, any other commercials that? I, I well, you know, recently I love. I, I want to at some point do a spot with my wife Blake, which I'm hoping to do soon. Um, I recently did a spot. Your Caitlin, Rob's wife, as many of you know, here is a comedic sniper. Uh, she's in, yeah, incredible. Um, I shot uh, I shot a little spot with her. Uh, recently, I do, I, you don't even know about this, but I think your producer knows about this, so I think we, should, we could actually run it if you want to see it. When a moment turns romantic, be ready with hymns. The fact is, 52% of men over 40 will experience some form of erectile dysfunction, so treating it is nothing to be embarrassed about. Unlike this, even the person who baked that bread should be embarrassed by whatever this is. But treating ED? That's simple at ForHims.com. When the time is right, will you be up for it? Visit ForHims.com today for a free consultation with a healthcare provider. Oh, hey guys. As the only star of the longest running live action comedy on television, there's one thing I've learned. And that's that there's nothing sunny about drugs. And anybody who tries to tell you different, well, they're really just not a part of your gang. To be clear, I mean illegal drugs, because some prescribed drugs are obviously OK. Like, if you're one of the 52% of men over 40 who will experience some form of ED, then getting a free consultation from a healthcare provider and medication through 4 it's nothing to be ashamed of. I want to be very clear, not getting help is actually kind of a dick move. <laughs> dick move. That's good. When I met Bob, I thought he was one of the funniest people I'd ever met. Oh yeah, we fell in love immediately. And one of the reasons is because Bob is so thoughtful. When I learned that more than 50% of men over 40 will experience some form of erectile dysfunction, I thought, where's the shame in acknowledging and treating that? Right, and the fact that he cares enough about us to do that is what I love most about him. <laughs> that and my hats, right? Sure. Visit ForHims.com today for a free consultation with a healthcare provider. Hello, men, you magnificent idiots. Let me fill you in on a little secret. No one cares if you use ED meds in the sack. The fact is, ED will affect more than half of men over 40 in some way. So being embarrassed for that is like being embarrassed for coming down with chicken pox. And that's stupid. So get over it. And go to 4 for a free consultation with a healthcare provider. It only takes a small amount of time. A perfectly decent sized amount of time. God, you guys are exhausting. Personally, I think they should make medication to get rid of erections. <laughs> That's just me, though. Yeah. And it's nearly, you know, it's quite common for men over 40. It's sort of like a, like a flu, but in your pants. <laughs> <laughs> Was that guy supposed to be me? No. <laughs> Relax, Hector Projector. That wasn't you. Let's not rush to judgment for all the facts are in. You know, you want to talk about outrage, the first version I did of this starred Baby Yoda. <laughs> Before you freak out, Baby Yoda, when we meet him in The Mandalorian, is 50 years old. The actual Yoda in Star Wars goes on to live to 900 years old before dying in Return of the Jedi. He also produced powerful erections right through his 700s. <laughs> so, then why didn't you use that? Because he looks nothing like you. So it is supposed to be me. We'll be right back with Caitlin Olsen, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah.